Okay, currently I am on uh, Beth Shan and I am facing east uh, towards Mount Gilboa, um, the area where Saul, Jonathan, um, were uh, killed during the battle with the Philistines. As I move slightly uh, up uh, towards the north um, is uh, the Jezreel Valley um, and Mount Moriah. You could basically see uh, in the distance uh, right over there. That area there would be Mount Moriah, Amoria, and then the Jezreel Valley would be right in between there. And that again is towards the uh, towards the west, uh, northwestern part. As I face uh, north, uh, that would also um, be towards um, Upper Galilee. Um, now, one thing that's interesting to note is uh, during the Battle of the Philistines, when God would not speak to Saul because Saul lost God's favor, uh, he went around uh, the Jezreel Valley uh, towards en Endor, which would actually be in this direction, uh, slightly above or to the right of Mount Morea. Uh, as I come around this area here, uh, this is towards the uh, east, uh, towards Lower Gilead, and the best ford to cross over is in this direction here, which you can't see, but uh, it's uh, over where that gentleman is over there. And um, this area is strategically important because of the trade, the uh, south uh, eastern trade route, which is um, uh, from Arabia and other places. And it's also strategically important uh, militarily uh, for all the people that have passed through here. So this was an area important to um, the, the north, uh, the Phoenicians, the Philistines, as well as from the southern par uh, part uh, where the uh, Egyptians are from. And they've all taken part of this area. At one point, they have uh, uh, have controlled this city. And uh, it's also strategically important for Saul because it was a launching pad city for uh, uniting uh, the um, Israelite tribes during his uh, monarchy uh, reign. Uh, right now, I'm facing uh, south uh, towards Jerusalem. And um, again, this is uh, the Tell of Beth Shan. So, presently, I'm standing uh, at the southern end of uh, Beth Shan, and uh, I am looking uh, at the uh, Scatopolis, which was used as a city by the Romans as an evangelistic tool. It's a Decapolis, it's called. Uh, directly in front, you will see uh, the theater right here. And this right here, this street directly to this right, is the Palladius Street. And directly over to the right is the bathhouse. That's with the dome-shaped kind of pyramid-shaped roof. Uh, as I scan in here, you can see it a little bit better. And again, it has the uh, the three parts: the the uh, Caldarian, uh, Frigidarian uh, area where they have bathhouse. Uh, there's three uh, of them all together. And uh, the Sigma, which is uh, right here, it's a semicircle area. And directly to the left, here, that would be the uh, Agora, which is the marketplace of the, um, of the, uh, uh, the, the town here, the city. And uh, the temple itself would be over in this area, right across, um, where you can see the central area is the, the Nymphium and the central monument, which is uh, right there, would be the, the temple there. And then also to give you a frame of reference, right in this area is um, Mount Gilboa, where Jonathan and Saul were killed. And up here, that tree there, that's where Judas hung himself from the uh, Jesus Christ superstar. And uh, the other thing I'd like to take note is uh, you see the what this whole city is made out of, even this gravel here. And then also you can see it here, uh, the blacker rocks. That's the basalt caused by the volcanic um, area uh, in the uh, northern part of uh, Israel, in the Galilee region. And again, as I come around, you can see the entire area of the Scatopolis. 
and and that's uh, from the south of Beth. Okay, I am currently looking north uh, towards the Tell of Bashan, and to give you a frame of reference, um, this is where we saw the uh, uh, the tree where Judas hung himself uh, from uh, Jesus Christ Superstar, and just reaching out here, coming back. And I'm presently standing in the Agora. And as I come this way, you can see the pillars. Uh, this is going to be facing uh, due west. And as I face coming around, this is facing south. And facing east. And over here, this is where the bathhouse would be, and the nymphalus or the uh, would be in this direction as well. And then again, that's towards the tell. Um, and the temple would be this way, and also around that uh, ridge area. This is also facing towards uh, Mount Gilboa and the Jezreel Valley. And again, I'm just going to scroll around. That would be where the Strange Street is, up around, uh, where the people are. You see a group of a uh, couple of people there walking. That would be the main street area. And again, this is the uh, Scythopolis, or Scythopolis, <clears throat> which is one of the Decapolises of the Roman uh, Romans would have built all this to evangelize the people into the Roman way uh, in their culture. So I'm presently standing in uh, Scythopolis, uh, which is south of uh, Bashan. To give you another frame of reference, there is the Tell of Bashan, which is uh, facing north, and this is facing west. And one of the things I wanted to show in particular is the structure of these buildings. As you can see, they're uh, they're black. And give you a close up of some of these. All the way around, look at the, re the remains. You can see walls and some doorways. And, and as I scroll out, um, one of the reasons I want to show you that is the structure of the buildings is from a material called basalt, which is caused by the volcanic activity in this area, or from old um, extinct volcanoes. And again, this is. Uh, to the west, and as I turn around, there's the bathhouse again, and back around to the tell of the.